active is your child? Think about it. At school, they're seated. Doing homework, seated again. What do they do for their downtime? Watch TV, play on their electronic device? Of course, that includes being seated again. We know that inactive or sedentary lifestyles can severely affect our health as adults and as children. That's why as parents, it's important that you set the example and model an active lifestyle for your kids. One of the problems why we have childhood obesity is because of uh, inactivity. They need more than that. The human body is kinetic. They have to get out and move. They have to be uh, some kind of, uh, um, do some kind of a modeling. They don't have to be perfect, right? We're not perfect. But you have to do some kind of a modeling and you have, and they have to, um, they have to, number one, they have to help kids to cultivate a taste for what's good for them, right? And I'm not just talking about food. I'm talking about the kind of activity that they get involved with. So um, the best way is, is like my dad did, if you can involve the, you know, you do things together. Um, for Ed, he learned to appreciate fitness course, from his dad and credits that exposure to his continued passion for health and fitness. My dad, you know, he was... Uh, kind of a fanatic, health fanatic, and, and I say so to the extremes. Um, so in terms of, you know, what you put in your body and, and but the, the main thing is every morning at five o'clock, my dad used to go to the barracks. You used to have a group of guys, um, sportsmen, Duncan Vernon was a cyclist, XYZ was a boxer, Dickie Gardner, he was a bodybuilder. A bunch of them, they used to meet out there in the morning and they used to run the circular. And then they used to jump in, this, in, the, in, the, in the barracks mm -hmm. and swim. And they would swim and swim and swim. Now, my job as a five-year-old was to watch their clothes. One day he said, come here. And I said, oh, OK. And I jumped up and I ran. And then he walked me out on the pier. And guess what he did? He pushed me in the water and walked away. That's how I learned to swim. <laughs> you can credit mm -hmm. your passion for fitness from your exposure as a child? Absolutely. I, I got hooked. I mean, it was like, um, like, um, like, a, like a healthy addiction to me and, and, and up to today. This was five years old and now, now I'm 60. I'm going to be 61, by the way, in September right here. <laughs> as a child, you know, activities like this that you can do with your dad or with any parent for that matter is really something you look forward to. William says, Getting active doesn't have to be complicated. He says aim for activities that can be done together as a family. We're, we're talking about two things, and it's a 70-30 ratio. Um, nutrition and lifestyle is 70%. Exercise is 30. Now, 30 may seem like a little, but that's significant. 30% is significant. Um, but. I like to use the broader term activity instead of talking about exercise because exercise is just a formal activity. Um, and there's many thing, there are many things that, can be, that we, we can do. I mean, even simply taking a walk. Look how beautiful Marine Parade is out here. I mean, we're missing out, you know, if we don't at least twice, once or twice a week take a walk, a ride, or something out here. Um, you can drive out there and park. And there is a nice park right there by Barn Bliss. Lots of activities that can be done. Okay. Another good thing that parents and kids can do is, is goof around a lot. Dance and, you know, and, 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 you know, there is nothing, no better exercise than cleaning house. You put on some music and you pump it up and you put on exercise gear and you start and, and bring the kids, everybody get them involved and you start cleaning. You'll be able to do a lot of squats and, and lifts and, you know, picking stuff up and cleaning. And all you want to do, you exaggerate the moves, right? Because basically that's what we do when we work out. It doesn't even matter if you, as the parent, are not your fittest. Children learn by example, and if they see parents care about fitness, they will too as they grow up. Children are good at following, mimicking, right? And um, if you model a good behavior for them, good technique, man, they'll pick right up on it and they'll, they'll do it perfect too. And if you, if you establish this as a foundation for them, then kids can build on this.